Friends, Apple's new macOS Sonoma has been demoed at WWDC. Let's take a look at what's inside. First up, widgets are now coming to the Mac desktop. We have seen it on the iPhone. We have seen it in the control center, but now you can get them on the desktop. That's great. A new game and some new gaming APIs were shown. Death Stranding was this game which was demoed, looks cool. One very interesting feature is camera and effects which you can use during your video calls. So you see over here, this is a Zoom meeting and this individual is able to move the slides behind him when presenting to his team, which is enabled by AI features which comes on the iPhone camera. If you go ahead and see, if you just do double thumbs up, you will see this celebration popping up behind you. That's again a camera effect. So several upgrades to camera if you're doing video calls using Zoom or Google Meet or Teams, you will have these effects and features for you. Safari is getting password sharing. So if you are using Keychain with an Apple to store your passwords, now you can share passwords with friends and family. That's pretty cool. Safari is also getting profiles. This, my friends, is huge. We have had profiles on Chrome, Brave, the whole Chrome engine for a while, but getting it now on Safari was a big request. Finally, it's happening. Now let's look at CarPlay. One interesting thing in CarPlay now is music sharing. So I could have my device connected, but anyone in the car with an iPhone can do music sharing with my device and that uses CarPlay. So there is no longer a need to fight as to whose phone would be connected to CarPlay. So that is huge. What I really love about the TV OS update from Apple is that, hey, you can do a FaceTime call on a TV and you can just place your iPhone uh, around the TV and you can use the continuity camera feature. And if you have an Apple TV, you can just use Face ID on TV. This is huge. I wish it was here during COVID. So several new home and audio features over here, the share play in car. That's interesting one. A lot of audio updates to AirPods as well. Maybe I'll make another video around that. So I thought you would want to know updates about this as well.